Hello, my brothers and sisters. Just came here with uh, a quick message. And uh, something that was on my heart, something uh, we've talked about quite often through Scripture and through uh, God's Word. The question that I have for people and even for myself as you look in the mirror, that one day where you find God, where is your true home? Is it heaven or is it on this planet? Remember Jesus said, uh, do not store up treasures on earth where moth and dust corrupt and thieves break in and seal. The store of treasures in heaven where moth and dust do not corrupt. The Bible also says in James, what is your life? It's like a vapor. A vapor is a mist. It gets into the air and just evaporates very quickly. Heaven is eternal and this world is temporary. He said to focus on the things that are eternal, not temporal. So where is your home? That's my question to you today. And unbelievers and believers, do you want to go home? Or are you good with what you have here? And you tell the Lord, stay back, Lord. I'm good. I'm okay with what I got. Take your time coming back. Or are you a believer who says, come now, Lord Jesus. Even so, come, Lord Jesus. It's a fall this is a fallen world. Temporary. It's evil. It's run by evil. It's run by the devil. Remember, God called him the prince of this world. He's called the God of this world. But everything he does is a lie and deception and hate. Are you ready to go home? Or are, are you okay with what you have here? Remember also what he told the rich man who said, Lord, I'll follow you, follow you wherever you go. Jesus said, sell everything you have and give to the poor. That man can, couldn't do it because he's holding on to the things of this world. Remember what Job said. I came into this world with nothing, and I'll surely leave with nothing. I came into this world naked, and I will leave naked. It's all temporary. It all gets washed away. The one thing that doesn't get washed away is the blood of Jesus Christ. Jesus is real. Jesus is God. And Jesus is the way to heaven, the only way to heaven. Do you know him? If you don't, try to find him. He's everywhere. He's everywhere in the book. He's everywhere in this world. He's truly sovereign. He wants to get to know you, and he wants you to believe on him. But you have that free will. You make the choice. Thank you all for listening. If you haven't hit the subscribe button, I ask that you do so. And I'm thankful if you do. May you all have a blessed evening. And God bless.